Hey, hello folks. Uh, we're gonna show you how um, all we could find in the freezer. Well, we don't have any ready-made food. All the leftover food's mostly gone. We have a little bit of leftovers for some guacamole I'm gonna make later. But we have a TV dinner here that my mother had bought some supplies of. And most people will normally just take a TV dinner and that's it. That's all toss they in the toss in the microwave and that's all they use, eat. And uh, TV dinners don't have much nutrition in them, in my own personal opinion, um, because it's processed food, it's been sitting, it's been... I don't know. It's cooked, then frozen, then cooked again. Right, exactly. Um, so, uh, this is more just for flavoring. Um, I don't know what this is. This is some white rice in it, I think. Yeah. But we're going to make... And, uh, yeah, we're using just... When we use TV dinners, we use it for just for flavoring, usually. Right. We're going to just use it for flavoring for what's ever in here. We don't even know what this is. We just, just... I don't like it. I don't like this one. I think I've had it before. I don't, I don't quite like it. Oh. Well... You blend it with my stuff. It... Awesome. Ex exactly. And so, um, what we're going to do is so that since that rice is not very nutritious rice, especially since it's white rice, we're going to add our own rice, which is a brown rice grain. Now also in this I added, um, what is this, some quinoa, just a little bit of quinoa for extra protein, and uh, um, some teff, and I also added some flax seeds. Um, uh, it's supposed to be good for your heart, and it's also nutrition. Oh, and then uh, that's an amaranth grain, yeah. so I also um, added a tiny bit of yeah, an amaranth grain. Amaranth, your rice, you have a little white amaranth grain, um, black, Black seeds and uh, kind of purplish, brownish quinoa. Quinoa seeds. Yeah. And you also added what are these? Some Those flavor. are a little bit of flavoring from coconut chips. Some flavored coconut chips and coconut adds oh, yeah, a little sitting, flavor. Sitting in the back of the fridge, yeah. Right. And then over here we have uh, some chaya greens, greens from you, uh, our garden, which has more magnesium than um, pretty much anything they you find at the grocery store. This when you first pick them. Yes, they do. And this is my son, and he is... Say hi, chef. Eagle. He's... Yeah, you're the chef. Uh, well, we are working together. Oh, and we're also going to add uh, a little bit of seaweed? of seaweed. Now, the first thing I'm going to do to get started is um, going to get the onions started because I realized the other day we were steaming the onions and they just didn't taste very good. So I decided that instead of... Having steamed onions, I liked them pre-grilled. I'm warming up this. It's on high. I'm going to probably turn it down to medium now. Yeah. Maybe simmer. You want it a little bit, so you want the onions to brown, and that gives what gives it the nice flavor. So I already cut off the amount of onion that I wanted to use, and then we're also going to add some sweet potato just to add some calories, some bulk, some vitamin A, especially during the season. Even though none of us have colds right now, if you have a cold, Vitamin A is what you want. Vitamin C is what you want. Want to prevent the cold. Vitamin A is what you want to once you have it. Once you have it. Yeah, All right. So, so um, which chunk of onion would you like me to cook? The smaller one, yes, please. Mm -hmm. Now I also do that because theoretically one could grow the bottom of the onion if they had a fresher onion. So you want to peel the onion first. You don't want that outside. Unless you really do want it, but push it out. Getting it off is the other part. Yeah, that's pretty hard. Right there with the entry goes. No, I probably should have cut that off. Um, yeah, we, so you can, yeah. I can just cut that off. Oops, watch my fingers. Get that off. your fingers. There. Yeah. Okay. I'll take it. Now, Eagle, there is still on this one. You what? Wait, let me show you. You just um, flipped. Oh, I see. I see why you didn't do it. Okay. Yeah, alright. It's fine. We've got enough on you. Yeah. I like chocolate just right now. Or even the, the, yeah, the top side. Mm -hmm. the top side, I like chocolate better because like, that comes off much easier. Yeah. And we didn't do this. There are much fancier ways. You can watch all those cool cooking shows. You're not watching our show to learn how to cook. You're watching our uh, channel because you're joining us for dinner. This is, you're decided to come to dinner with us. 
Mm -hmm. Or I guess you could learn to cook, but I mean, I don't exactly do that much of it. Well, I guess tonight I did have the idea. I was teaching how you extend a regular TV dinner. You just use it for flavoring, and then you add all these other ingredients. I think uh, the, now, the inside uh, takes a little while, but I like the day where I pull you apart. Um, you know, you cook them a lot. You cut it a lot faster if you do it together. Mm -hmm. well, now, I, I was thinking we would do it this way. No, I'm going to make onion rings. Um, are you going to actually eat the onions or rings? Because we're not going to, we're not doing, we're not baking batter tonight. We're just well, having it part, be part of the flavor. Longer, and I want right? you to eat it. I want longer, not chopped up in chips. I don't like chopped up in chips. I like longer better. Well, I'm hoping to actually get you to eat it. Well, then, like, pulverize it. <laughs> Like, you know, My bet, Eagle, is that in other meals, well, yes, when I've done that, that, that's fine, we can do that. Okay, that, that's how I get it. That's sense, and so it's fine. Otherwise, I pull it out. This can take a while, so uh, I'm going to pause the video. No. Okay. It's also going to be fun. Only six minutes in. For greens, we have that other fancy tool, which we'll show you. Quite work, uh, well, evidently not very good at showing, cutting things. Yeah, it's an art form. Mm -hmm. This person is not Can you cut up the rest of the onion, too? Mm -hmm. The one or, oh, how about I take this one? This one looks fine enough. I'm going to go ahead and put it in the thing and start it grilling so I can get it stirring. Oh, needs more cutting. Eagle, that is small enough. It really is. Right, it right shrinks. Now, remember, wait, remember when you cook onions, it shrinks a lot. I guess, okay. So I'm going to remove... Like to chop this. Yeah, here, I'm going to give you this. I'm going to chop it like this, just for one of them, and these pop the pans pop one. Pop up. Ouch! Woo! Right there? Yep. Grab it. It's hot pan. And oh, I touched, touched it. Touched pan? Yes. Yeah. Right. Yep. Yeah. Amazing. Even though I brought it down to low, it's still... Oops, you know what I forgot is a thing to uh, stir. Do I have the... Yeah, it's over there. Can you... No, up above the pan. Where? Left. No. Left. Above the pan. No. Above the pan. Right there. Right there. You're facing on the pan. Fix one that. of the yes. I didn't, I didn't oh, yes. the, the now, one. This is what happens when you have it too high. See how it blackens, and so you need to stir it right away. Hopefully those charred pieces will not upset you too much. I'm going to put them off to the edge of the pan because it is too blackened. Too, yeah, it's a little bit charred. I'll these off. So you're learning how not to do it from our cooking channel, not how to do it. So. Uh, or at least, yes, yeah, 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 don't do the mistakes we do, right? Yeah, don't make, so don't turn it on we too high. We did the videos our home, because we're professional idiots. So we blow stuff up so you don't have to. Is that from, uh, what, cha what channel is that? <laughs> yeah, this is uh, the overall idea of people like putting stuff up. Oh, are you talking about the other channels? Uh, Grant, you know, stuff, yeah. Do they actually say that? Uh, some of the little videos he said. Yeah. Oh, I see. So this one, it's, um, yeah, you can tell it blackened. And that's just because I put it, I had the pan on high, and even though I had turned it down to sim, or actually I guess I had turned it down to a little bit of below medium. But see, now it's not cooking that well because we just turned it down to sim, so it's it's like, it's it's a hard tie in balance, yes. Let's see what happens when we turn it. Ah, so you hear them steaming a lot less. Oh, it already smells good. Now, people also normally cook with oil, and I could do that. Now, uh, these nice long ones, I'm going to leave, okay? Okay. Um, I'm going to just cook them. Oh, you know what? We actually should have cooked the sweet potato first in there, because it's going to take longer. Yeah, you're right. In fact, if you could cut me up a couple of chunks of sweet potato to get in there. You really have a couple of chunks kind of cooked up. Now, if you're not going to be stirring it, the other thing is to put water in it. Yeah. Do you think you could um, chunk up some of those for me, please? Yeah, really strongly. So, are you getting the the yeah. tears from the onion? 
There's some cute YouTube video I saw of all the different tr things you can do to make it so that your eyes don't water. Yeah, like stay in the room onions for your enti for an entire year. No, it wasn't that we got accustomed to it. Like you can put some smoke or just toss it in. Yeah, toss it in. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and toss this bit in. Okay, toss this in. Okay. Yep. What is ridiculous? It's, it's all stuck in the... All the chunks are stuffed. I don't even know I dropped them off. <laughs> the outer skin layer is so thick. Yeah. I hate when that. Why are so many chocolate anymore? Wow. Okay. Loud sound. Sorry. Can you not do it? You don't need to do it that loud. In fact, I'm, I'm really... Not trying to. Well, it's called rolling the knife. I eat like this. I, normally, I think I start, yes, from the front, front back. Thank you. See, much quieter. And normally you make that a lot. Of, well, yeah, it's not a machete. You're not a an axe going chop, 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 chop. Why not? That's fun. It might be fun, but it's hard on the ears, especially for anybody listening in. Uh, can we, you know what, since, well, your thumb was just dangerously in there. Okay, I personally suggest... Don't cut that right. Uh, doing it where you're doing it. Um, and you, again, roll it, please. Thank you. You don't hear the chefs in the kitchen going, slam, 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 okay, slam. Sometimes you do. Not for the good chefs. Oops, I'm not stirring this fast enough. What you're doing. You know what, I think I also might add some water in here. Yeah, it's getting a little sticky. Especially when you have sweet potato in there, you want a little bit of water. I'm going to pause this. Okay, so... So do you pause. want to uh, use the tire shift here? Ooh, there we go. Great sound. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come That's not, it's not videoing. Oh. It's just, just... Well, that would have been a good idea. Well, except for the steam going up. Cool. Yeah. Okay. We should do okay. So again, you learn what not to do. You don't pour a ton of water in. Normally, I would just put a little bit of water. Yeah. And we're gonna steam it. And now you just soaked and it. Also, now I've also lost a lot of that heat. Wait, I just what? Soaked it. That's a, oh, that's all right. The water's all gonna steam off eventually. So this adds some flavoring. This adds some starch. Should I use the entire, the entire Yes, please. Stew? That way we can have maybe some leftovers for tomorrow. Hey, Eagle, what did I say about... You don't like me going... Dum! Maybe you'll listen to the camera afterwards and you'll realize why. Uh -huh. Plus, it's completely unnecessary and it hurts my ears. Sorry. Okay. Oh, whoa, whoa. Okay. I'm mean, going to worry about your thumbs. Thumbs. So it's very close. It's not close whatsoever. Go ahead and flip it on its flat side. There you go. And now cut it. Ah, oh yes, that works too. Thank you. I don't know if you noticed that we're eagle. I don't know if you noticed that we were leaving the skins on. We washed the skins. At least I hope I did. 
hope you at least rinsed the dam. Yeah, I did rinse it. Okay, good. You want to make sure it's rinsed or clean because you don't know where they were grazing, unless you know the farm and you know it's sustainable.